put as much power as you can into the ball. Do you know why? Because when I give more force, it'll go farther. Yes, but also because the way not to get hurt is to apply more momentum into the ball than the ball applies on you. This should be an elastic collision. Do you know what elastic collision means? No. Well, let's look at that. Pause. If the potential energy is completely converted back into kinetic energy after the collision, the collision is called an elastic collision. What does that mean? It means when you head the ball, you should apply more momentum to the ball than the ball applies to you and therefore making the energy, instead of going into your valuable little head filled with all this knowledge about physics, it goes into the ball. Good. Now, you can't head and make it 100% elastic. You will feel some of the pressure, right? Yeah. And you, some of the momentum will go into you, but you want the least possible to. Let's talk about how to make that happen. Let's talk about giving the ball more momentum. Okay. Momentum is mass times velocity. Cool. Remember that. Let's see you try to knock the ball out of my hand. Huh. Good try. Let's try again. Better. Now, what were you doing that really helped you? Applying more pressure? Yes. But you were leaning back. Why were you leaning back? To increase the elasticity. No. <laughs> Let's figure out how to increase momentum. It's good enough. <laughs> what you need to do is include your whole body so you have more mass and you're hitting the ball with more of that mass. Let's see. Good. Hit it harder. Harder. <laughs> Don't use your nose either. Hit it harder. 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 Come on, Kayla. Harder! <laughs> now you hold the ball, I'll do it. Hold it high. I burned my nose. <laughs> Can I get it? <laughs>